Good day everyone, teacher Onings here and today ipapakita ko po sa inyo ang aking official entry para po sa Class in Online Teaching Exhibition Philippines. With concern to the Data Privacy Act, lahat po ng mga bata na nag-participate dito ay may mga parents' consent. Sana po magustahan ninyo and do not forget to vote. Thank you. Alright, it's already 4. Good afternoon, Nash. <laughs> So, the tutorial. So, for now, so mamaya, I will give you uh, permission to talk as we go along with our discussion. Welcome once more to, to our health class. This afternoon's lesson focuses on health. All right, Nash, I want you to read our lesson this afternoon. Resources and facilities in the community and their importance. Identify the community community health resources and facilities that we utilize to address a, a variety of personal health issues, personal health issues and concerns. Discuss the importance of community health resources and facilities. Thank you, Dash. As a review, Dash, we have tackled um, several lessons on your self-learning modules and I want you to take focus on this one. So I have here my PowerPoint. So, okay, Dash, you're going to health resources or facilities being referred to in each number. All you have to do is to choose the letter of the correct answer from the given word inside the box. Sasabihin mo lang ang letter na sa inaakala mo, Nash, ay tamang sagot. Okay, number one. Okay, so meron na tayong isang classmate dyan. Very good. Okay, so number one, it is a facility that offers dental or oral care. What do you think is the correct answer, Nash? Letter D po, dental clinic. Very good. Let dental clinic and for that you have your first trophy next number two okay number two question is for um dato alden this is specialist for muscular disorders to give hands on again so since tatlo na kayo so muna kayo lahat Okay, so i-mute ko muna kayo lahat. So, since na kayo, gamit na tayo dito ng slot machine. Kung sino yung, alright, kung sino po yung uh, matatapat dito sa ating slot machine, siya po yung sasagot. Okay, wait lang ha. Uurong lang natin yung ating slot machine sa gilid. Alright, for number two question, for number two question, this is a specialist for muscular disorders who gives hands-on hands -on care and prescribed exercises to persons with injuries, disabilities, and other health conditions. Okay, using this slot machine. Okay, so Nash... Your turn to answer. Physical therapist po. Okay, your answer is letter E, physical therapist, and that is correct. Okay, so you will be having your second trophy. Okay, next. Number three question is... It refers to services like treatment, consultation, vaccination, and surgery are being offered in this facility. Using again the slot machine. Oh, no. Nash, na wala yung isang classmate mo. So, mukhang ikaw ulit yung sasagot. All right, Nash, what do you think is the correct answer? Jacob Barangay Health Center. All right, very good. You are again correct. And for that, you'll be having again your third trophy. 
hindi na natin gagamitin ang ating slot machine this time kasi mag-isa ka na lang ulit. Number four is, this facility provides medical care to children, teachers, and other school personnel. What do you think is the correct answer, Nash? This is a community health resource that assists doctors in giving health care to patients. What do you think is the correct answer? B. Nurse. All right, letter B. Do you are correct, nurse? It's a community health resource that assists doctors. Very good. Number seven. This specialist offers eye care to persons with eye problems. What do you think is the correct answer, Nash? Eye ophthalmologist. Very good. Okay, and so once more, you are correct. Number eight. Over-the-counter and prescription medicines that help in the wellness of people are being sold in this community facility. What is that facility, Dash? Drugstore C. Very good. Correct answer is letter C. Moving on, number nine. It is a facility that offers health services to people living in barangays or barrios. What is the answer, Dash? Barangay Health Center. And you are correct. Very good. You've got your ninth trophy. And last number, I hope na ma-perfect mo. This is a community... <coughs> Excuse me. This is a community health resource that performs operations and surgical related cases. What is the answer, Nash? E, surgery. Very good. And for that, you the perfect score. Congratulations. Very good. So that means that you really have added your self-learning module. All right. So moving on. We come now to our formal lesson. You are going to watch the video on a different community human resources specifically the healthcare providers and the different community healthcare resources and facilities. Here are your guide question, Nash. Number one, can you read the first guide question? I'm sorry, okay, mute mo, unmute muna kita. Okay, what is the first question, Nash? Name the different healthcare providers. What are their jobs? And number two, what are the different community health care resources and facilities? What are their importance? All right. So those are guide questions. All right. So may I share my screen with you? Good morning. The community human resources are here today to tell you the roles or responsibilities that they perform each day. They will let us know the importance as health care providers. Let us find out. And read with me. This is a dentist. She gives dental care by checking the overall status of the teeth and gums in the mouth. She do teeth or tooth extraction, cleaning, surgery, and alignment like putting braces or retainers. This one is a doctor. He do physical and medical examinations to diagnose or know your diseases or ailments. He give advice on your health needs. This one is a nurse. He assists the doctor or she assists the doctor in giving health care. He check your vital signs like blood pressure and pulse rate. He also gives medicines to be taken in and shots or injections to make you well. Now this one is a pediatrician. She is a specialist in children's health and diseases. She gives vaccines to boost their immune system. She also monitors their growth and she also prescribes medicines 
if they are ill or not feeling well. This one is a midwife. She offers services to women during pregnancy and childbirth. She also sees to it that the mother and child are in healthy condition through checkups and medicine prescriptions. Now this one is an ophthalmologist or eye doctor. She treats persons with poor eye conditions and diseases. She also performs eye surgery. Eye corrections like eyeglasses and contact lenses are available in her clinic. Now this one is a dermatologist. She specializes in skin problems and diseases. She offers services like facial treatment and surgery. She also prescribes creams and medicines to answer your skin needs. Now this one is a physical therapist, a specialist in muscular disorder. She also gives hands-on care prescribed exercises to persons with injuries, disabilities, and other health conditions that need treatment. This one is a cardiologist, a specialist in heart diseases. She performs heart surgeries or operations. She also gives advice on how you're going to take care of your heart. Now, these are surgeons. They perform operations and other surgical-related cases. Community human, resources or community human resources are healthcare specialists and providers who give health services to people. They are very important because they do checkups and give advice or counseling to make the patients aware of their health status. Treatments and medications are also offered for the people in the community to achieve a healthy condition. You have met the different community human resources, specifically the healthcare providers. Now, here are the community resources and facilities that provide amenities and services to address the personal health issues and concerns of people. Let's learn the importance of each one. Hospital. This is a facility for consultation, treatment, surgery, and hospitalization of patients. Different doctors or specialists are working here to serve your health needs. All the other one is a nutrition health center. It is a facility that rolls out programs like advocacy or good nutrition feeding program and giving of free vitamins and minerals for good nutrition. Nutritionists and other health workers offer services here. This one is a first aid station. It is a station that gives emergency care or treatment before medical aid be given. First aid supplies are kept here. Health volunteers, first aid helpers, and providers are here to, to respond your needs. Now this one is a drugstore or a pharmacy. Medicines are sold in this store or facility. Pharmacists work here to sell medicines and help patients on the use of prescribed and over-the-counter drugs. This one is a dental clinic. Oral or dental care is offered in this facility. Dentists are working here to treat gums and teeth problems. While this one is a maternity clinic or birthing center, this facility provides care to women's health during pregnancy, childbirth, and postpartum, or after birth. Midwives and other healthcare workers offer services to make sure that the mother and her baby is in good condition. While this one is a laboratory clinic, laboratory tests in blood, urine, stool, and saliva, as well as x-ray and ultrasound are offered here. Medical technologists, other healthcare professionals, 
and vacations over here. While this one is a Barangay Health Center or Barangay Health Station, health assessment for people in barangays or rural areas are being offered in this facility. Barangay health workers or PHW and health volunteers work in this facility. This one is a city health center. This facility offers health care to people who are living in the city or urban area. Doctors, nurses, pharmacists, midwives, and medical technologists work here. While this one is a school clinic, this facility offers health care needs to children, teachers, and other personnel in school. Nurses and dentists are working here to give health care. Remember, community health resources and facilities offer needed health services to people. These are available to address personal health issues and concerns. Thank you. Uh, we are finished watching the video. Can you give Nash um, an example, at least one or two um, healthcare providers in our community? Yes, Nash. Dentist gives dental care. Doctor gives physical med gives physical med medication. Very good. And then number two, can you give uh, different community health care resources and facilities? Hospital talk. Very good, Dash. And what is the importance of hospital? Pwede sumagot ng Tagalog. To save people's lives. Very good. To save people's lives. All right. And it is where... Doctors cure different diseases of different people with different diseases and disorders. What else? What uh, other community health care resources and facilities do you know? Drugstore. All right, drugstore. And what is the importance of a drugstore? Nagbibigay po sila ng recommended na damot. Tama, very good, you are right. So, drugstores not only sell different kinds of medicines, but some pharmacists or pharmacists inside the drugstore recommend uh, prescribed medicines for that specific illness or diseases. And also, we have our school clinic, definitely. We have school clinic to, uh, to facilitate and assess our teaching and not teaching personnel, for example, the teacher, the principals, and of course, the children or the pupils inside the school. We also have the Barangay Health Center. We also have the first aid station. We also have um, the dental clinic and many other community health care providers or resources and facilities that are very important in our lives. All right, so moving on with our activities. So we're going to play Roll the Dice. We have an ace here. Okay, so let's put Ngayon, this time, bibigyan ko ng authority. So, dalawa kayo ni Warren. So, gagamit tayo ng slot machine. Kung sino mauna sa inyo. Pagkakin natin siya dito. Okay. So, this time, I'll give you authorities. I'll give you down. Okay. So, meron dito isa. Then, meron din si Justine. Okay, so tingnan natin kung sino mauna. Let's do the, use this slot machine. Alright, so it's Nash. Nash, roll the dice. 
Okay, pa paano mo siya ga? Ayan, very good. All right, sa so number three, sasagutin mo ang question number three. Okay, so what is the importance of Barangay Health Center to the people in the community? Letter A, for giving relief goods during typhoons. Letter B, for entertainment or letter C, for health services like check-up and vaccination. What is your answer? C, for free health services like check-up and vaccination. Very good. So once more, you are correct. You'll get your reward. Uh, yeah, ang um, sunod na sasagot. Let's have the slot machine. Warren, you roll the dice. Pindutin mo lang yung dice, Warren. Alright. Number two. Question number two. The question is, Lisa has difficulty in urinating or pag-ihi. Her parents decided to bring her to a laboratory clinic. Why is that so? Letter A, for urine test. Letter B, for nutrition counseling. Letter C, for deworming. What is the correct answer? Warren? Warren, what is the correct answer? What do you think is the correct answer? Nahirapan daw si Lisa. Uh, um, sasabihin mo lang. Okay, si, Ma si Warren, sorry. Okay, si correct answer. Ang isinulat niya dito ay letter A. Susulat siya ng letter A. So, is that your answer, Warren? Sorry, nakamute ka pala kanina. Uh, you can, you can talk to uh, Warren. Uh, wait lang. Okay. Is that your answer, Warren? Letter A? Apo. All right. So, for your ring test, you are correct. So, meron kang... All right. So, you have your first trophy. All right. Next. Okay. Let's use again the slot machine. Yeah. Domino, sino si Domino? Domingo, Kyle, Justin. Kyle, roll the dice. Domingo, sir. Di Domingo, sir. Okay, number four. Question number four, um, Kyle. The kids noticed a first aid station in the street. Minapansin ko yung isang first aid station sa isang kalsada. What is the importance of this health facility? Okay, uh, choices. For free medicines, letter B. For emergency care or treatment, letter C. For free training to those who want to be doctors. Um... B, sir, or A? <laughs> B, sir. Is, okay. Sure ka na ba doon? Letter B or letter C? B, sir. Sure na sure. B, sir. Letter B sir. for emergency or treatment. Very good. And for that, okay, you have your first trophy. All right, next, roll the dice. Ah, slot machine. Well, sino ang sunod na mag-roll ng dice? Okay. All right, Nash. Roll the dice again. Number three is taken already. Roll again. Okay. Okay, number five. Question number five. What is Number five. Dindo has developed rashes. 
nagkarashes daw si Dindo due to a very high fever. He is experiencing headache and has been vomiting for days. Nagsuso pa na siya ng mga ilang araw. They brought Dindo to the hospital. Why is that so? Letter A, for dental assessment. Letter B, for advice or proper nutrition. Or letter C, for immediate treatment. C, for immediate treatment. Very good na. Your answer is correct. Therefore, meron kayo naman isang trophy. Alright, next. Isa na lang, sino kaya ang magbubukas ng question number one? Let's use this slot machine. Okay. Marvin. Wala ka na pala. Wala ka na pala ibang choice kundi number one sa so hindi ka na magro-roll ng dice. The question is, the pupils are playing in the playground. Somebody got jured. What they do and why? A. Bring the injured pupil to the school clinic for first aid or attention. Letter B. Go to the drugstore and buy medicines for the injured pupil. A book. Injured pupil and return to the classroom. Your answer is letter A, bring the injured pupil to the school clinic for first aid or medical attention. Very good. You have your trophy again. All right. So, very good, guys. So, next activity. Ano kaya ang susunod dating activity? Okay. This time, nako, bakit nawala yung mga trophy? Pinakikita kayo hindi dito sizes meron okay. ano ko muna kayo minaki sir ha parang ayun na tayo mga sizes sir minakita kayo minakikita kayo dito meron sa gilid may hospital surgery yan may red tama oo all right tapos so, ganito yung gagawin na. Pasahin mo. Uh, you will be... Ako kayo, ilan taong dito? So, we have Loy, Susan, uh, Tama-tama. So, Nash will be Loy, Susan will be Kyle, Susan will be Juan. And then, syempre, babasahin nyo na rin yung mga saka ko siya i-check kung tama. Alright, Dash, start. Let's start with the importance of Barangay Health Center. Barangay Health Center offers health assessment to the people in Barangay of Rula and areas. Area. Area. Rula. Good. Okay. Maternity clinic or birthing center is a facility for women who, who are pregnant or who are about to give birth. Very good. Continue. Kyle. Laboratory tests like blood tests, urine tests, and stool examination are offered laboratory clinic for the people to know status of their health. Children and teenagers also avail services in school because they use the school clinic as a health facility. The Good. community health resources, wood dogs, physical and medical examination of diagnosed patient disease is a doctor. Very good. It is the work of a physical therapist 
to help people with muscular disorder. Very good. Yes, you. Yes, you are not employed. The cardiologist is a specialist that treats heart diseases. The ophthalmologist is also called an eye doctor who specializes in diseases or eye problems. Services like cons consultation, vaccination, and surgery are being offered in the hospital with the doctors and nurses of duty. Very good. Free services like check-up and vaccination in barangay or, or rural areas are offered in barangay health center. Very good. Okay, so that's very good naman. Alright, so last activity. So this form, anong sabi na? Choose a letter A if the statement is true and B if it's false. Alright, so this time, so parang gagawa tayo ng Pero dito, in this na natin sagot tingo, you will be answering A for true and for false. Okay, so number one, pharmacy is a community facility where medicines are being sold for people's wellness or education. Once again, A for true, B for false. What is your answer? Ipin dito nyo na. Uh, uh, ayan. Ako. Okay. Nag-answer na. Nag-answer na kayo? Ako, sir. Ako, sir. Alright. What is your answer? A. A, sir. Very good. A, A is correct. Next, surgeon, okay, bawasan natin. Surgeon is a specialist in skin problems or diseases. True or false? Finish? What is your answer? I sir. The correct answer is letter B, false. Okay. So, ang trabaho ng doktor ay mag-conduct ng several operations. Okay. Number three. School clinic is a facility in school that gives health care services to pupils, teachers, and other personnel in school. True or Alright, so pares kayo. Ang tabang sagot ay A, true. Next, number four. Dentist is a specialist that treats gums and teeth problems. Okay. True or false? Okay. So, nakita ko yung sagot nila. Your answer is true. Letter A. Very good. Sir, nakakadunod lang ng aking ngipin, sir eh. Ay, ganun? Oo, sige. Parehas tayo. Ako nung isang go. Next, number five. Laboratory test. Ay, wait lang. Yung aking selector. Laboratory test. Our test in blood, urine, stool, saliva, and x-ray and ultrasound are offered in Barangay Health Center or Station. A or B, true or false? All right, very good. The answer is false. Okay, so mm -hmm. ang laboratory test ng blood, urine, saan is sinasa? 
laboratory clinic. Alright, very good. Sa laboratory clinic. Oh, mamaya na ako magbibigay ng trophies. Next, number six. Pediatrician is a specialist in children's health and diseases. True or false? Your answer, Kyle? Doctor. Ah? <laughs> All right. So the answer is true. Okay. So tama yung sagot. All right. Number seven. A midwife offers health services to women during childbirth. Choose. All right. So, sagot ninyo yung dalawa ay true. And that is A. correct. Letter A. Next, number, number eight. Hospital is a facility for consultation, treatment, surgery, and hospitalization needs of patients. Okay, true or false? Okay, si Kyle, si Nan. <laughs> Alright. Mm -hmm. May nagbabago ng isip. Sige na. Okay. So, you've answered. True. Okay, so the answer is letter A, true. Okay, and number nine, a physical therapist is a specialist in muscular disorders who gives hands-on care and prescribed exercises to persons with injuries, disabilities, and, and other health conditions that need treatment. Okay, A or B? True. Okay, hati ang sagot ng dalawa. The answer is letter A, true. Okay. Ah. And last number 10. A cardiologist is a specialist in eye conditions and diseases. True or false? A or B? <laughs> All right. The answer is letter B. Letter B. Okay, it's false. Ano po yung trabaho ng cardiologist? Yes, okay. Nakakap ng cardiologist sa heart problems. Okay, very good. I will be giving you your rewards. Okay, so for now, one, two, two, three, okay, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Kyle, we have one, two, three, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, very good. Good job. And that ends our lesson. So, so permitted ba ako ng parent ninyo na okay lang i-post yung recorded video sa YouTube? Opo. Okay, so maraming salamat pakasabi sa parents ninyo. Maraming salamat. That ends our lesson for today. Thank you. Bye-bye. Ingat po kayo. Yes, sir. Bye-bye, sir. Uh